Hi, this video is on assignment number four. So assignment number four is very similar to uh, what we did in class on Tuesday, um, where we added a register page, a login page, a welcome page, reset password, logout, adding, um, adding a row to the product page. So let's take a look at what the requirements of assignment four is. Okay, so basically it's very similar to your class activity on Tuesday. In this assignment, we're going to add the PHP pages to your assignment three, which is the Kona website on your WAMP or MAMP server. So you're going to create the following pages. You'll have a register page where you register um, or sign up, okay? And then you will have a login page where you will log in. Okay, so login page look like that. And then after you log in, uh, you will have the welcome page. On this page, you'll have links to resetting the password, logging out, and adding page. So let me try and log in here. All right, so this is the welcome page. You have your reset password, sign out of your account, and add to the products page. So all these three links, you have that, okay? So another page then you have to have is reset your password page, right? And another page that you have is your logout page. And that logout page doesn't actually show as you are logged out. It actually just takes you back to your login page, okay? So, and I wrote that note here, it doesn't actually show up as a page, but the logout will be an option on the welcome page. And then you have a add page to add a new coffee product. So let's go log in again. Okay, and here we have add to the products page, so you have a page where you're allowed to add uh, some records to your page. Now, of course, this is the example of boss at home we're look looking at, but you're actually going to be working on your, um, your Kona website, okay? So don't be confused that I'm showing you a different website. And of course, you have an insert PHP file, but this doesn't actually show up as a page, but it performs the function of adding the data to the coffee table, okay? So the first thing you're gonna have to do is to create a new table in your database called users, okay? So users um, in your Kona database, of course. This is my boss database, but you'll be going to your Kona database and adding a table called users. And in there is where um, when you register, the user's information will go into there, all right? And in your navigation, PHP, I would like you to add the following links, a link to login page and register page, okay? So, look like that. So up here you have a login and then a register up here to add to your page. Of course, this would be for a Kona website, right? Not the boss at home, okay? And also I'd like you to add the header, nav, footer, um, using the include PHP function to all the pages. So you have to add it to all the pages, all the pages here, okay? So add header, footer, navigation to all these pages. And you have to link all the pages to your style.css. All your pages must have style added to it. Um, yeah, and just make sure that the header, nav, footer, uh, using the include function is added to all the pages. And I would like you to submit the following. So the export a SQL table. Um, you guys did a great job with your last assignment uh, submitting this. So just keep doing that. And then all your zipped folder containing all your web files. So your entire Kona folder again, please zip it up and please save it as a dot zip Z I P extension, not an R A R. So please send it as a zip. Uh, file. All right, and then this is the last one, which is lengthier than the last time. Uh, I'm requiring you that you um, show me a video that all your pages work, so all the eight steps below. So show yourself registering with the new username and password. Okay, so I would like you to go to register. 
Okay, and new username and password. So I'm gonna name this Bob and I have a new password one. And then I'm going to submit. Oh, okay, so I'm still under Yin. So, okay, so let me just sign out first and then I can try this all over again. Okay, so I'm going to have a new username. Oh, this is, I'm required to. Okay, there we go. So let me just go to register again, dot PHP. All right, let's try this again. So this time I'm gonna call myself Tim and I will have a password. Okay, so this is where you would start your video. All right. And I'm gonna go over here to my users to see if that got entered. So yes, yeah, so both Bob and Tim got entered, okay? And now I'm going to use either Bob or Tim. So in, the, in, in your video, you would show, sorry, in your video, you would show yourself registering. So like I just did with the new username and password, I, I, I registered with Bob or Tim and entered password. Then I'm going to go to my users table and PHP my admin to show that this was entered. So I have to go here. In, in your video, you would then go to your users table to show me that indeed it got entered here. Okay. And then after that, you will go back to your website and log in with the new password and login name. Okay. So I'm going to pass login with the username and the new password okay to show me that works all right and then I'm gonna go to my ad page to show that I can add a new row of coffee product okay so then I'm gonna go to add and product name would be okay so this would be actually your coffee um, So you would actually be entering the name of your coffee, okay, and uh, not products. But anyway, you get the idea, you would enter the new product, and then you have to go back here and show me in your coffees table that you did enter the new product. So I just enter this here. There we go. So you have to go to your PHP my admin again to show me that you did enter that. Okay. Here we go. So to go to your coffee table in PHP my admin, they show me that this was entered in the table. And then go back to your website to reset the password. All right, so I'm gonna go back to welcome page. I'm gonna reset my password. Bob and then oh. there we go. Reset password. Okay, then you have to show me that that works. And then log in again. And then finally, the last thing you would need to show me is that finally log out. Okay, so then you have to go to your sign out and then it would take you to the login page. And those are the eight steps that you have to show me in your video, okay? So just like you did last time, which by the way, you did a great job with that as well. So now your video is just going to be a bit longer and then you would submit this uh, by next Monday, okay? So any questions about this, if you're having any trouble at all, please get a hold of me and I can um, we can meet online and I can explain this. Um, individually to you. All right, so um, again, this is due uh, on the following Monday, and it is out of 10 points.